Hello, Tim Connolly here. Tonight I'm going to go over backing up and restoring the SD card for the ZWO ASI Air. I notice a few people having issues backing up and restoring their card, so I'm going to put together a quick tutorial showing how I do this using Win32 Disk Imager version 1.0 on my Windows PC. The first step is to remove the micro SD card from the ZWO ASI Air device. Plug that into your card reader and insert that into your computer. When you insert it into the computer, you may be prompted to format the SD card. You want to hit cancel. Do not format the SD card because you'll lose the operating system which is on the SD card. When you look at the folder which has the operating system, you'll notice there's text documents, some files, and a file folder titled image. The image folder is going to have no files in it. This is where your images are saved to during your imaging session, and it also will have a folder uh, for logs. So note that the boot drive is E. I'm going to pull up the Win32 disk imager and I'm going to ensure that the device is on the E drive. If I click on the blue folder it's going to open up uh, the target where it's going to be saved to. So it's going to be saved to my downloads folder. I'm going to cancel out of that. I'm going to name the file ZWO ASI Air Backup And then I'm going to click read. So this is going to read uh, the file and create a backup. And it should take about 20, 20 to 30 minutes to do. I'm going to pause the recording while it continues to read uh, the file and create the backup. All right, so Win32 Disk Imager just finished. It says read successful. So now I'm going to go into the download folder and verify that the backup is there and it is 31 gigabytes in size. So it looks like the backup file was successful. So I'm going to close out of that. And that is how you create the backup file. So now it's time to restore the SD card. When the ASI Air can't be started due to an SD card failure or to, because of a corrupt SD card, uh, we need to restore the image file, which we backed up previously. So now we're going to put the SD card back into the reader and plug the reader back into the USB drive on the computer. I'm going to open up the file and you'll see the USB drive which is in my the E drive. I'm going to right click on it and format it. I'm just going to do a quick format on it just to make sure it's a clean card and it gets rid of anything that was previously on it that could be corrupt or that could uh, screw up the restore. Now I'm going to open Win32 Disk Imager and I'm going to direct it to the E drive where my uh, file is and you can go back in and verify that it's in the E drive. I'm going to direct it to the file. And here it is, the ZWO ASI Air backup. And I'm just going to verify that it's the 31 gigabyte file. You can see I did a backup previously. However, it's only 5 gigabytes. So that tells me there was an error in that uh, backup. So I'm just going to delete that one, get that out of here. So now what we're going to do is, once we have that selected, we're going to go down 
and we're going to click on write. So now we're going to write our image file to the E drive. And we're going to get a warning about writing to a physical device can corrupt the device. Are you sure you want to continue? Yes. And this is, again, it'll take about 20 to 30 minutes uh, to write that file to the SD card. It's really important that when you're writing this file, the SD card that you're going to be writing to is at least 32 gigabytes in size. The one I'm using right now is a 64 gigabyte card. Uh, it doesn't matter the size of the card. It's always going to have 25 gigabytes of space allocated to it for your storage. So you could use a... 64 gigabyte card and regardless you're only going to have 25 gigabytes of storage so i'm going to pause the video while this goes and i'll be right back all right so win32 disk imager just successfully uh, finished writing to the new sd card i'm going to go and verify that it is there you can see now the E drive is now named boot. Open that up and I have my files and I have the ZWO AIR license file and also have the empty image file. So now this SD card is all restored and ready to go. This is the end of backing up and restoring the SD card on Windows PC. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me on Facebook, or also on my website, astronorth.com. I'll be glad to help you out and answer any questions you have.